Good, Chair. Well, as we ease back into the school year, Rankin County School District leaders are making sure that students stay safe. As WJTV 12's Margaret Ann Carter reports tonight, they held their Come Together Parents and Community Forum. Two of the main topics during tonight's discussion was bullying and suicide. Experts say the number one way to stop both of those is knowing your child. Like in my daughter's case, they never physically did anything to her. It was all my text messaging, but they kept telling her to kill herself, to kill herself. She needs to kill herself. You're fat and ugly. Nobody ever wants you. You just need to kill yourself. And so she decided that's what she'd do one day. Thankfully, Jody Dices' teenage daughter was unsuccessful in her attempt. But there are thousands of students who end their life because of bullying. And many times the parent never sees it coming. Kids are good about deleting messages. My daughter hid it from us. It wasn't like she brought it to us. Um, she, she would delete the messages. We had no clue. For eight months, I had no idea anything. I knew she was changing. Uh, this outgoing kid then become reclusive. She didn't want to go to ball games, didn't want to go shopping. Dice says pay attention to changes in your child's behavior. She changed the way she looked almost every week. I mean, her hair color and style changed on a regular basis. She was doing anything hoping that, that the, the words would quit. And be involved in their social media activity, something Todd Ward takes very seriously. It's dangerous in some in some ways because we don't always know who they're talking to, who they're who they're who's seeing them, who they're seeing, and that sort of thing. So it's important that we understand as parents how we can uh, make the most of that and how we can keep our kids safe. Reporting in Rankin County, Margaret Ann Carter, WJTV 12.